Hello viewers, welcome to Igima Solutions. So in this video, we are going to learn how to perform simple additions with Abacus. So let us quickly find the answer to these additions of numbers. We have 5 plus 2, we have 7 plus 6, 9 plus 3 on the Abacus. So now let us make our Abacus to be 0. So now by assuming this to be my unit, so I have 5 plus 2. So I represent abacus 5 as this. This is 5, then plus 2. On the unit rod, I have 4 bit, then I have to push 2 to touch the equal part so that the abacus is now 7. So the value of the abacus is 7, which is my answer. So 5 plus 2 is 7. Is that clear? Okay, let me make it 0. Okay, let us solve the second problem which is 7 plus 6. So I have to present 7 on the abacus. This is my unit rod, so I have 5 here, plus 2, which is 7, okay? So I have to look for 6 on the unit rod, and I don't have 6, so I have to move to the 10th rod to borrow 110, so that to remove 4, because I'm looking for 6. So I have to borrow 10, I remove 4. So here, under my lower bit, I don't have 4, I have only 2 bit, but the upper bit, I have 5. So I have to subtract 5 and add 1 from the lower bit to make it 4. So hence, the value of the abacus is 1, 3, which is 13. Therefore, 7 plus 6 is 13. Okay? So let me make the abacus to be 0. So let us solve this next, the last one, which is 9 plus 3. So I have to present 9 first on the abacus. This is my unit rod, for example, 5, 4. This is 9 on the abacus, then plus 3. So I don't have any bits left on the unit rod, so I have to go to the 10th rod. So that to borrow 1 10, I'll subtract 7. So on the unit rod, I have to subtract 7. Here I have 5, then I have to subtract 2 also. So that the value on the abacus is 1, 2, which is 12. So therefore, 9 plus 3 is 12. So this is how to perform the simple additions with abacus. Thank you very much for watching.